Paul Ryan no longer speaker? What he just found out has him sprinting out the Capitol door. Over the past few months, we have been really disgusted with Paul Ryan and his treatment, or should I say, disdain for President Trump. As Speaker of the House, Paul Ryan was unable to work with his own House Republican members, and refused to work with the President on repealing Obamacare. This should have been the easiest bill to pass in the House, as Americans are chomping at the bit for better health care. Instead, he gave us bad bill that didn't make it to the floor for a vote. Now, we're seeing the same issues when it comes to tax reform. Let's just say that America is fed up with the likes of Paul Ryan, and now there is a poll that should force him to think about resigning as Speaker of the House. From Independent Journal Review while the Trump team is likely toasting to their growing approval, up to 50 percent, one member of the Republican Party is going to have to put the celebration on hold. According to a Pew Research study, only 29 percent of Americans approve of Speaker of the House Paul Ryan. The dismal approval ratings for Ryan come after he failed to replace the Affordable Care Act, something that Americans blame Ryan for more than they blame President Trump. As well Americans should. Paul Ryan made a complete spectacle of himself and completely embarrassed the Republican Party. Even now, the Freedom Caucus has created a great bill that would repeal and replace Obamacare. Most Republicans are on board, but yet Paul Ryan has yet to move the bill into committee to ultimately go to the floor. Why? We can only speculate that his ego is so bruised from his first Obamacare attempt that he couldn't handle the fact that a better bill without his name on it is more well received. It's important to note that Ryan's low approval ratings aren't just a Republican versus Democrat phenomenon. Ryan is much more disliked than several of his predecessors. According to Time, 75% of Democrats disapprove of Ryan's job performance. Less than half of Democrats minus 49% disapproved of Boners, and 61% disapproved of Gingrich's. As for those before Ryan, Time notes. Former House Speaker John Boner had a 36% approval rating. House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi, then House Speaker, had a 35% approval rating, and former House Speaker Newt Gingrich scored 43%. Ouch! If your approval rating is lower than Nancy Pelosi's, it may be time to leave. Do you agree? Thank you for watching this video. What do you think about this? Share this on Facebook and Twitter along with your comments. comments.